Guys, welcome to the fifth part of Excel for Beginners. In this, we will cover what is row, what is a column, and how powerful the help function is of the Excel. Before moving forward, if you have not subscribed to my channel till now, please go down, click on the red subscribe button, and also click on the bell icon so that you can get notification for all my future videos and take advantage to the fullest. So let's get started. Well guys, as I always say, Excel is a very powerful tool. So just to demonstrate that here, I will show you how many cells and how many rows and columns are there in Excel. I will come to cell A1 and from here, believe me, there are more than 16,000 columns. All these vertical standing things are called columns. And to go on the rightmost column, instead of pressing the right key again and again 16,000 times, the command I will use is control and right arrow. Here you will see that we have reached column XFD. Let me show you here what that means. If I click right and go to Z, here you'll see after Z, A, A starts. So from A, 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 B and so on. And similarly, it goes till the last. So that is why I say there are more than 16,000 columns when we go to XFD in the Excel workbook. So similarly, now let me show you how many rows are available in the Excel. You may not believe it, but yes, there are more than 10 lakhs. To be precise, 10,48,576 rows are available in Excel. So now just imagine so many columns, so many rows, how much data can you put in a single workbook? And that is the reason, if you remember in one of my previous videos, I showed you why there is an option of calculation to be automatic and manual. With so much data, if you are doing automatic calculation, it will take a long time just to save or refresh and your efficiency will go down. So guys, I know it's small, small, things but it helps you increase your efficiency or vice versa now i want to discuss the help feature of the excel and everyone knows pressing f1 will open up the help center and we can go and do a lot of help queries there but i want to show you that excel starts providing help at such basic levels that you may have used it but never realized it if i bring my mouse cursor to the fill color here it shows me fill color color the background of the cells to make them stand out and if I want more details about it, I can always go at the bottom of this particular new window where it says, tell me more. And if I click on it, a new window will be opened, which will be providing much more information on this particular command. Here you can see that whatever information you might ever think of regarding a, such a small command as fill is available here. And similarly, you can go and click on any command, any help and take benefit of that. So let me close this and move on. One of the things I really, really like about Excel is this feature, tell me what you want to do. So if I'm unsure about any command, I can just go and type here. Let's say for example, I want to insert rows only and I type in here, insert rows. So here it will show me all the options available. Number one, insert, insert sheet rows, insert several other options, object, insert picture. And also it is showing me at the bottom that if I go on the help tab, there are 10 results available. So there'll be many more things which I can do with this. So as I say, it's a very small thing, but it will help you gain a lot of efficiency. So guys, we'll end the video here and I hope you have taken advantage of all my previous videos. If not, I'll be providing the links in the description box below. If you have not already subscribed to my channel, please go down, click the red subscribe button and also the bell icon so that you get the notification for all my future videos. And, and I have uploaded certain bonus videos for you so that you can see them, be motivated and also learn to use along with learning the basics of the Excel. So guys, thanks a lot for watching the video till now. Thank you again. Take care. Bye-bye.